right, Freddie. Uh, second week here, you're back on the pitch at UBC. Just, uh, just talk about uh, just how great it is to be back out here, seeing a few of the familiar faces. Yeah, we have missed these feelings, coming back, seeing our friends, happy, you know, smiling at, you know, uh, the pitch, knowing that we're gonna train soon, and this is the step one to to get the, you know, final. Uh, phase when we are going to be all together in the field, but uh, at the moment we are feeling good with this type of work that we're doing. And can you talk a little bit what the workout you are doing? Is it focusing primarily on running, getting some touches on the ball, passing off a bounce board? What, what are you guys working on? Yeah, fitness, uh, trying to get in touch with the ball as well, little by little. Uh, there is not, mu not much that you can do by yourself. Soccer is a team sport, you know, where you have to play with your teammates, pass the ball. And uh, for now, it's, you know, just following the rules. And during the two months of quarantine, you had the opportunity to spend a lot more time with your family. I imagine your two little girls kept you busy and, and running around all over the place. <laughs> just uh, talk about life at home and, and uh, how, how that went. It went good. Uh, I mean, we're still enjoying our days together. Uh, it got, you know, it challenged uh, sometimes. It's not easy to uh, always uh, keep entertain six years old and four years old uh, little girls, but uh, God is good and we're always uh, happy, you know, to have this opportunity in our lives. I don't know if, if something like this will happen in the future, but hey, we have to be uh, content in any uh, season in our life. How excited are you to be back? Like talking to the guys and just like on the drive in, they're getting butterflies again, <laughs> listening to the music. You feeling the same, Freddie? I feel the same. I feel happy to see the ugly faces, some of them uh, <laughs> handsome. But uh, let me tell you, we, we can't wait until we can all be together in the field. It's a, a feeling that we cannot uh, uh, say that we don't miss. And we're closer than before. And that's what excited. Back on the pitch, second week here. Just uh, talk a little bit about what the, the guys are focusing on right now. Yeah, I mean, uh, two months away from the pitch is it's crazy, man. Uh, but uh, you know, we're all happy to be back. Uh, a lot of joy, a lot of smiles going around, and uh, we just have to be ready for for whatever. So uh, the boys are trying to get back physically, and uh, it's honestly it's, it's been great. Um, it's just we're just all happy to be back. Doing a lot of Zoom sessions and uh, individual workouts and the, throughout those two months. How great is it now to see the guys in person and, and have a little back and forth? Yeah, I mean, uh, those two months, uh, it was hard being away from the pitch, uh, being away from our teammates, you know. Uh, uh, we're not used to this, uh, nobody is, but uh, well, since we've been back, I know we haven't got the chance to see everybody all together, but uh, we have our little groups and, you know, it's just, uh, my group, group of guys, it's been fun. Crack a lot of jokes, you know. Uh, just all around, there's a lot of good energy going around, and uh, we're just all happy to be to be back on uh, in the field. We see, obviously, you guys are working on fitness primarily, and touches with the ball. What, what specifically are you looking to focus on during this period? Uh, obviously, physically, uh, even though. Uh, you, you can do stuff at your house. You can. I was obviously everybody else was training. Uh, we were following our programs, but obviously you don't you don't feel uh, as fit as you were before the break. And you just the most important thing right now is getting fit and uh, and go from there. You know, uh, obviously we have we have our things limited, which is uh, contact with other teammates, uh, passing the ball. So it's just right now it's all about individually individual uh, training and f uh, trying to get as fit as possible. No, I feel good. Uh, uh, I still have a lot to work on, but you know, uh, no one knows what's going to happen uh, within these next couple, I don't know, days, weeks, months, anything. So uh, just we just got to keep it day by day, and uh, I'm sure in a week or two I'll be 100% where I, where I left off before the break. So. Um, just quickly, uh, we, we didn't get a chance to catch up with you last week.
week, we were talking to guys like Max and Ryan who said that they were just like blasting tunes the whole drive in here. They were so excited. Was, was the excitement the same with you? Yeah, of course, of course. Uh, coming into training, uh, I drive leaving my house at 7:30, uh, just blasting the, those tunes. You know, trying to get trying to get amped as I am. Uh, just waking up in the mornings to come here. Um, uh, it's just a good feeling to come to drive here and. Obviously, there's no traffic, so it's, it's even good for me. But uh, uh, just all around, just happy to be back with the boys. So after this, do you go back into Mr. Cavallini and start teaching again? Yeah, of course. Uh, that's my, my, my second job for the day. Uh, I never knew I could become a teacher, but without going to university. So <laughs> it's been good. It's been good. <laughs>